have a good day. LA Beast here, and what I'm about to do, does it involve harmful and dangerous acts according to the YouTube community guidelines and standards? No. What you're about to witness with your own eyeballs is 100% safe and done in a controlled environment. And let's not forget that I am in fact part of SAG-AFTRA as a professional stuntman. So do not recreate or reenact anything that you see in this video, even though it's safe. So without further ado, let's get started. Uh, mind blown. Now besides delicious ginormous Chipotle burritos and fresh jumbo shrimp, as you can see right here, to where a New York Knicks game back in 2019, I could only eat 20. Steak is my favorite food of all time. And for my 35th birthday down in Washington, D.C., I had a steak. For my 36th birthday last year, I got the meat sweats, consuming a four and a half pound prime rib. And for my 37th birthday, I enjoyed a delicious ribeye. And all that I plan on doing right here, right now, is grilling up a top sirloin, delicious marinated steak that I got from Oradell Prime Meat Market. And just like they do at Peter Luker's Steakhouse, they take the juices and douse the steak in it for flavor. And what I'm going to do instead of doing that is dousing my steak in denatonium benzoate, the world's most bitter compound. Why? Because I'm about to have the world's most bitter steak. Denatonium benzoate is the most bitter substance known in the world, according to Guinness Book of World Records. And just one little tablespoon dumped into an Olympic-sized swimming pool, which contains two and a half million liters of water, somebody would be able to detect the bitterness. And despite the extremity of how bitter denatonium benzoate is, it is actually harmless if consumed by a human being. To which if a human being actually consumed denatonium benzoate would not get ill or throw up. The extreme bitterness would actually make them want to spit it out because it actually tastes like 100% absolute stank. So I think it's actually going to be pretty interesting to see if I can consume my favorite food of all time while battling the most bitter substance compound known to man. So all I plan on doing right here right now is going downstairs, grilling up this steak, uh, and then I'm going to actually prepare the denatonium benzoate. Take some eyedroppers, drop it on this steak, and enjoy my dinner. So stay tuned. I have a delicious medium rare steak resting underneath this tin foil right here. And while that's doing that, what I'm going to do very carefully is transfer this bitter Bitrix solution to where Bitrix ingredients include water, sodium chloride, which is salt, and then denatonium benzoate. Uh, I'm going to carefully transfer it from this vial into this glass and then use this eyedropper to quite possibly ruin a $30 sirloin steak. So without further ado, again, I have gloves on. Uh, I'll speed up this process, but uh, I'm just going to squeeze where it says squeeze here. Okay. Uh, okay, I did that. And... Alright, there we go. We're, we're actually getting a few drops. Okay, we're getting a lot of drops. And, and just this little bit right here, uh, if dumped into an Olympic, Olympic size swim, swimming pool, Jesus. And just this little bit right here, right now, if dumped into a swimming pool, could be tasted. Okay, that's a lot of bitterness. Okay, well... We'll speed this up. Without further ado, I am the LA Beast. And I'm about to make the world's most bitter steak. Why? Because I enjoy the challenge. Uh, so without further ado, oh boy. All right, honestly, uh, this in this glass right here, there's really not a whole lot of it. Uh, there's no smell. I'm going to take my camera uh, and very carefully, I'm going to place the glass. Uh, we'll place it right here. Uh, what am I going to do? And, and, and I'll just show that I'm putting droplets 
of the world's most bitter substance onto this steak. Okay, we know what? That's a decent amount. Um, let's go like this. That's, that's a decent amount. Okay, boom. We'll just start right there. Uh, just get a nice... Oh, that, that's a lot. We'll just get a nice little coating on that side. Um, see what I can get. We'll go in the middle. Oh, my God. I, I think I definitely think the last time I actually tried to... Oh, boy. The last time I tried to... Okay, I can't speak here. The last time I failed to eat a steak uh, was in high school, and I actually put Tabasco hot sauce at the time to where I wasn't uh, acclimated to heat like I am now. Okay. And I actually couldn't finish a steak. And this, this may be the second time in my life to where uh, I'm going to take a fine cut of meat. Sorry, vegans out there, and quite possibly fail. You know what? Maybe I will become vegan after this. But probably not. Just get a couple more drops. The camera's a little bit blurry. Uh, okay, you know what? Great. Uh, I'll definitely say, uh, considering one little teaspoon, um, you can taste the bitterness. Th that's good for now. So, uh, hmm. I will safely place this down on the ground. I don't have any drink, and that's okay. I am the LA Beast. <laughs> Here we go. Let's see. Let's see if this is actually really that bitter. I have my sweet, oh, sweet Ken Shun knife. Delicious steak. Have a good day. It's already not good. Uh, uh, this is Remedy. Oh. This is reminiscent of when I uh, put Bitrix in Warheads. Now uh, I'm already getting that stank flavor. Okay, here we go. Mm. Second, second bite wasn't bad. Uh. Oh, it's a, oh, it's like somebody farting in your mouth. Okay. Uh, if this next bite isn't really bad, then I'll put some more on there. Uh, it's like if a dragon was breathing fire, uh, but instead a human being breathing farts from their mouth. Okay. Mm. You know what? I'm the LA Beast. No, I don't play around. Jesus, this is bad. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh! <coughs> oh! <sighs> okay. Oh, I'm pretty sure this is going to be not great. <coughs> Almost just lost it. And again! Oh! Now it's getting a little bit nauseating. It's getting a little bit nauseating here. Uh, and again, uh, this is not a harmful or dangerous act. This is not a harmful, dangerous act. 
I am consuming something that is what is it? I'm consuming something. Okay. Oh my god. No. Uh, I don't know where it was. I'm, I'm consuming, consuming something, something that is 100% absolutely safe. It's just, it's just, it's just the most bitter game ever. It's just the most bitter compound known to man. And what this compound is, I can't speak. Oh my God. I'm like, I'm like physically stopped in my tracks here. This is, this is not happening. Like I, the first couple bites are fine. I don't know what that that last bite uh, is. Right where the drops went. Uh, it's very stank. And, and what that Antonio Benzo actually used for uh, is like poison control or their poison prevention to where like uh, cleaning products underneath the sink. Um, they put that Antonio Benzo in there. So if, if accidentally swallowed, uh, you're not gonna want to take another sip. Jesus. Oh. Okay, um, okay, this may be the last bite of steak on the LA Beast. Have a good day! I'm not giving up, I'm not giving up that easy. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> this this looks like a delicious piece of steak. Uh, honest to God, uh, I just made it the worst piece of steak. That's it, that's it, that's literally all I can handle. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, uh, again. It's just, it, it's so bitter that it's nauseating. Um, literally, my, my entire tongue right now is just coated um, in like bitter farts. Uh, it's like eating 99% cacao chocolate. Except it's just, it's really bad. The bitterness is not going away. Whew. Whoa. G good. Good. You know what? I'm glad it works to, to help uh, poison prevention safety. Great. And, and you know what? Should Benetoni Benz be put on steaks? Probably not. No, but 100%. Like, uh, I, I would definitely say that steak is my favorite food. Um... This was a delicious two pound top sirloin uh, and I was literally stopped in my tracks. And whatever this, this stank in my mouth is, now I need to figure a way to get it out. But whew, now I, I literally cannot consume any more of this. Now, and or you know what, could I? Probably not. But even if I could, I don't want to. So interesting, that was an interesting human science experiment. I'm the LA beast. And I failed to consume one of my favorite foods of all time because I doused it in the most bitter substance known to man.
Denethonium Benzoid. It's the CLA Beast. Have a good day! Ooh. Mind blown. Uh, today, which is October 5th, 2021, is a sad day, as I've never wasted uh, a steak, and especially delicious uh, marinated $30 top sirloin. Uh, I, I, I just, honest to God, like, I, I've tried Denethonium Benzoin for uh, and I totally forgot how bitter it really is. Um, so, crazy, crazy, uh, mind blown here today. It's the LA Beast. Have a good day.